You guys know that I've been using the SG Timer for over three years now. With that said, SG Timer also comes with the Go Timer, which is completely new, completely different design. So first thing, let's talk about the, the similarities of the SG Timer and the SG Timer Go. Both of these have the same exact sensor that the SG Timer had also comes with this one. It'll be accurate. It'll also subdue some of the other disturbances, the noises outside if you're shooting indoor ranges. It has a really great battery lifetime. Both of them do that. I've already explained that with this one and some of you guys have already seen me use that. I don't, I barely charge my timer itself. Um, the second thing is that you could still access and it still connects to the app, the drills app itself, which allows for you to be able to access advanced features such as create stages and drills and stuff like that. And then it'll go through and record your current progress and shots and all that stuff on the app itself. Now let's talk about the differences between the SG Timer and the SG Timer Go. You have this quick release. It's a very easy configurable thing that you can just throw on your belt. Um, if I need to take it off and give it to my dad or whoever, they can hold it and then I can slide it back on if I'm recording myself. The second thing is this is way louder than this one. Um, the other difference is that this is no longer waterproof or water resistant as this is, right? The last big difference on this, on these two timers, right here, I can change the pretext and the settings all on the timer itself. I can go up and down, create the delay, instant or random, three buttons all in here and make those adjustments. With this Go timer, you now have this small button that if you do your long presses, you can change the presetting from your training mode to your dry fire mode to your RO mode or whatever else and then you can start going to go back to shooting and then you can change to your preset by just tapping this simply going from one preset to the next you can still access all of those features that you had here and make those changes in the app itself but once i have it set i don't have to touch it again biggest difference on this is that this is a little bit more expensive than this doesn't mean that it's built less quality it is built the same exact care as the original one that we all fell in love with if i work on inclement weather I'll take this guy. I don't want this guy to get wet because as it, it'll pull water in there. It's not quite waterproof. This is water resistant and it, it'll fight water better than this one. Every single one of them has their own feature that you like. This one I like that it's in straight up. And this one I like because I can adjust all the features in here. Both of them are just as good.